Hey guys, it's Miss Trapp. I was just coming on here today to check in on you and I want you to know that I miss y'all so much. I miss seeing you every day and I hope y'all are staying safe at home and making sure you're washing your hands good with soap and water. Um, if you're in my class, then you already have good practice at washing your hands because you know Miss Trapp always makes us <laughs> wash our hands excessively. Um, I just wanted to read a story that I really love today with y'all. We have already read a story about Peepa Cat and this is a new one. And I think it pertains to things that, that are going on in the world today. So one of our skills, one of our reading skills this week is making connections and making comparisons. So as I'm reading this story, I really want you to think about maybe how you compare to another character in the story. It could be Pete the Cat, or it could be another character. But that's what I want you to do as I'm reading. All right, this is Pete the Cat and his magic sunglasses. Pete the Cat did not feel happy. Pete had never, ever, ever, ever been grumpy before. Pete had the blue cat blues. So he's feeling really sad. Then, as if things were not bad enough, along came Grumpy Toad. Grumpy Toad was not happy. He always wore a frown. Can y'all show me your frowns? But Grumpy Toad was not grumpy today. He said, these cool blue magic sunglasses make the blues go away. They help you see things in a whole new way. Pete put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and he looked all around. Right on. The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, I'm feeling all right. So just by putting on these sunglasses, it's totally changed his perspective. Pete thanked Grumpy Toad for the cool blue magic sunglasses. He went on his way and soon he saw Squirrel. Squirrel did not look happy. Pete said, what's wrong, Squirrel? I am so mad. Nothing is going my way. I only found one acorn today. Pete said, well, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They help you see things in a whole new way. So let's take a minute to stop and think about a time that maybe you were having just a bad day and it just seemed like nothing was going your way. What I want you to think about, what was the thing that turned it around? Was there something good that you could find in that day that maybe turned your whole day around? Squirrel put on his cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around. Awesome! The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, I'm feeling all right. So you see, it's almost like a chain reaction. Everyone who puts on these glasses sees the world in a whole new way. Pete said goodbye to Squirrel and continued on his way. Soon he saw his friend Turtle. Turtle did not look happy. What's wrong, Turtle, Pete asked. I am so frustrated. Nothing is going my way. I am all upside down. You can't really see the pictures from here, but he's all the way upside down and he can't get back up. <laughs> so right now, let's go ahead and make a prediction. What do you think is gonna happen next? Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They will help you see things in a whole new way. Turtle put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked all around, far out. The birds are singing, the sky is bright, the sun is shining, I'm feeling all right. Pete kept rolling along until he saw Alligator. Alligator did not look happy. What's wrong, Alligator? Pete asked. I'm so sad. Nothing is going my way. No one wants to play with me today. So you see, every character that we encounter has a big problem and nothing seems to be going their way. 
Pete said, try these cool blue magic sunglasses. They will help you see things in a whole new way. Alligator put on the cool blue magic sunglasses and looked around. Rockin'. The birds are singing. The sky is bright. The sun is shining. I'm feeling all right. Pete was rolling along and feeling all right when suddenly he fell back. The cool blue magic sunglasses went crack. Okay, if you were in my class, then you know what type of figure of speech. It's crack. Okay, I'll give you a minute to think. Good job. It is an onomatopoeia. Uh-oh. Pete didn't know what to do without those sunglasses. Just then, Pete looked up at the tree. Wise old owl said, Pete, you don't need magic sunglasses to see things in a new way. Just remember to look for the good in every day. Pete looked around with his sunglasses. Too cool. The birds are singing. The sky is bright. Excuse me. That was without his glasses. He did it this time without his sunglasses at all. And he said, the birds are singing. The sky is bright. The sun is shining. We're feeling all right. That's it. The end. But I just want to take a minute to think about the lesson that you learned from this story and think about maybe you not having a very good day we can always always look around us and see the good in the day and there is always going to be good around us you just have to look for it i miss you guys bye